Good morning and welcome to Wake Up With Jay. This is Sunday, July the 11th, 2010 and we're on the third of seven steps to success. Today's topic is persistency. Now, before we get into that, let's go ahead and knock out Jay's quote for today. And it's a good one. Thoughts are things. They have tremendous power. Thoughts of doubt and fear are pathways to failure. When you conquer negative attitudes or doubt and fear, you conquer failure. Thoughts crystallize into habit and habit solidifies into circumstances. That was by Mr. Brian Adams. So, Jay's thoughts for today. Remember the topic is persistency. So let's take a look at persistency. Persistency. Refusing to give up especially when faced with opposition or difficulty continuing firmly or steadily and then uh, persistence the act of continually pursuing something in spite of obstacles I always like to use me <laughs> and I always like to go back to my courting my now wife of 43 years believe me folks I had to be persistent. What's that one say there? Uh, the act of continuing pursuing something in spite of obstacles. The obstacles was I was trying to of course get a date with my wife. It took me six months, six months of persistency to get that date. But look, success. I've now got 43 years of marriage behind me okay so you, if you want something you got to be persistent but what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to do some direct reading from the book for the next few minutes to get my point across because I found a nice story in this um, uh, ebook seven steps to success okay it says here please follow with me if having a dream committing to its ultimate achievement is something like plotting your final destination ahead of an exciting journey, then persistency is rather like the engine you need in order to get there. And then it says, persistency is what drives you to take the next step in your journey. Persistency is what prevents you from getting discouraged by what may have happened in the past. Persistency is where the rubber meets the road. Now here's the story I was telling you about. Here's a story of an unknown origin that illustrates persistence is what persistency is all about. I'm going to go back and read that. Here's a story of an unknown ori origin that, I'm having a great day, that illustrates what persistency is all about. Isn't it good to be able to laugh at yourself? Okay. Um, there was a certain man who went to meet a famous guru to ask which way is success. Okay. The Birol Bearded Sage did not speak but pointed into a place far off in the distance. The man, thrilled by the prospect of quick and easy success, rushed off in the appropriate direction. Okay, Suddenly there was a loud splat. Eventually the man limped back, tattered and stunned, assuming he must have misinterpreted the message. He repeated his question to the guru who again pointed silently in the same direction. The man obediently walked off once more. This time the splat was deafening and when the man crawled back he was bloody, broken, tattered and irate. And he says, I ask you which way is success? He yelled at the guru. I followed the direction you indicated and all I got was splatted. No more of this pointing talk. Only then did the wise guru speak and what he said was this. Success is that way. Just a little further than a splat. Okay. Translating your dreams into an action plan and then constantly taking actions each and every day that will move you in the direction of your goal is what will get you there in the end. No matter how big your goal, you can get there if you keep your destination in mind and then continue to take action that move you towards the goal. 
That's common sense. When you meet an obstacle, as you inevitably will, persistence determines that you will, I'm sorry, what you will do. Whether you will give up or keep going. Persistence is what gets you back on your feet and dusted down and ready to do again. Persistence is what gets you past the splat. Now, let's go ahead and interpret that splat. That splat in reality, if you think about it, that's that obstacle. Okay, We all set goals and we know there will be detours or obstacles along the way. Okay, But your persistency in pursuing whatever that goal is that you have is what's going to get you past that obstacle or that splat. Okay, So, I hope you've enjoyed the lesson for today. All right. Just remember my 43 year ring. I was persistent and I was very successful. All right. 43 years worth. You can do the same thing. You just have to be persistent. Have that goal, see it out there, and let nothing stop you from getting there. All right. So, look, I want you to go out and have an awesome day. Please, as I always request, please bless someone. And whatever you do, tell them that Jay sent you. Now, as you know, that ringing in the back means that this is a live tape. I can't stop it. Say, y'all, have an awesome day. Don't forget Tuesday, 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, Blog Talk Radio, me and Harrison Action. God bless.